Matt, hard fought start to the season. Uh, one all draw in the end, fair result? Yeah, I think it was. Um, as you say, hard fought, two very close and even teams. Uh, I thought we were the better side first half. Um, and again, you can feel the breeze going down the pitch and we certainly had it with us, kicking down the hill with the breeze and, and we managed to get a little bit of momentum going, albeit with a couple of substitutions and stoppages, which really made it a long first half. Um, but I was, I was disappointed with the goal, of course, um, but I was also disappointed we didn't capitalise on one or two of the other chances we had in the first half. Second half, yeah, they certainly had it and they penned us back at times and had to deal with, deal with numerous long throws that we uh, that we tweaked slightly and certainly dealt with a lot better uh, and defended our box very, very well um, and, and unfortunately we had the best chance at the half with, with Josh hitting the bar unfortunately we couldn't get a nick, nick up I say an undeserved win but as I say I think the draw is a fair result the long throws that came in we dealt with absolutely every one except the one that they, they scored from and that came sort of from the throw in after Ben Goodliffe had, had had to be substituted was was there an element of that having an effect no, on it at all or no, was it just no, not at all no, no it was nothing to do with that uh, it was just a slight tweak as I say when you, you're doing organisation and preparation in, in pre-season uh, you, you're getting us you know the footage of the other teams where we've gone and watched all, all of uh, Newport's games and, and not once has Demetrio taken uh, long throws from either side uh, to be fair it's more Norman on the right hand side here uh, but his throws are a real weapon uh, and you know into the, the bodies that they've got there it's coming in flat, it's coming in the middle of the goal and uh, it's something we really have to, uh, to, had to deal with today other than the goal. So at half-time we, we just tweaked how we did it a little bit um, and, and changed a little bit how we, we dealt with the throw and second half we were miles better. And you say about the stoppages in the first half, it was a, a bit of a stop-start half. Physios were on quite a lot and we've had to make the two changes um, and particularly with, in the substitution situation at the moment that makes presumably makes the second half a little bit difficult when you've got three substitutions but only one chance to make them. Exactly. When you, it's, it's unfortunate for us that two forced injured subs before half time it's, it's really uh, um, affected it, whether you're making five subs or whether you're making three to, to be have two forced upon you in the first half is, is hard to deal with especially first game of the season um, so we, we had to try and make those that last substitution uh, as late as possible if you like and, and make sure we get it right um, and just bringing Harry and Kwame on a bit of fresh legs and, uh, and I think they both did well Two key players that went off as well in the first half Goodliffe and uh, Will, Will Randall's a big, big blow Certainly was. They're both, you know, doing really well. And, and Goody, he's not sure what he's done to his knee, but just a little bit sore there. And then Will's just a bad dead leg. So we'll see how that settles down in the next few days. And Omar scoring first goal of the season for the third third season on the <laughs> on the on the on, in a row. Yeah. So so Oliver from from SUFC TV told us. Um, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Good 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 finish after Donovan had done brilliantly. Yeah, he, he, Donovan did well. Um, good build up play. Donovan hitting the rat in the bar. Omar fin finishing it. And like you say, yeah, scoring against Maidenhead and Forest Green last year. And then again today against Newport, so three in a row. And in the in the second half, was there a point where you were well, were happy with the draw, or were you, did you always really want to push on? Um, for, I mean, you want to push on for the win, but well, when they gave that, that back pass, <laughs> which which just clipped <laughs> off um, that their player in the box, I was probably saying yeah, I'll take a point now. So no, no, late on, yeah, I still feel we might have been a threat on the counter attack, but yeah, listen, it, first first game of the season point on the board whether you're at home or away it doesn't matter you're up and running you, you've got a point and, uh, and against a very good side who I'm sure will be there or thereabouts uh, with some good players and a good manager so no, we, we take the point and we move on and after uh, yeah, it's been a, been a busy busy pre-season uh, uh, we said a hard fought first game of the season so quite pleased to have a week now before the, the trip up to Doncaster next yeah, Saturday yeah I think it does I, I, think, I always think that you know, like last year you go to away to Forest Green it's hard for and you, you have the sucker punch at the end there and you've got to go immediately away in the League Cup to, to Cardiff and a player champion Championship side, so it's actually nice this year with us having and then just having a nice week leading into to Doncaster away on Saturday and then the MK Dons game. And over three thousand in the ground again, good atmosphere, and they they've probably gone home thinking they saw a decent game. Yeah, I, I would think so. Two really hard fought, competitive, um, certainly chances for both sides. Um, but no, they were another a big positive crowd in, in the holiday season, and I know a lot of people are away and, and couldn't make today. So it's pos pro a positive and promising signs for us to, to increase that attendances. And one thing I haven't checked the records, but it, I think it's very rare in Saints history that the, the outfield starting ten in the first game of one season have all been players who've been with the club who were with the club the previous season. Right, that's. Uh, Another start in no time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, was it a tough selection before the game? Yeah, it was because we, we had some certainly some good pre-season performances and um, some lads putting pressure under people, not just for the starting eleven, but also for the bench as well. But as I said to the players in the team meeting we had this week, it's going to be a long old season. We played fifty odd games, late fifties last year. We're going to need everybody, uh, and, and this, this was just the first of many. Well, well done, Matt. This afternoon, good game, and we'll uh, see you at Doncaster. Brilliant. Thanks a lot. Cheers, Tony.